If you are like me, spending Chinese New Year aboard, don't feel lonely. I'm here with you. Hello! To those who celebrate Chinese New Year alone like me, we can do some nails together. And of course, we choose the red one. Good luck! Hi, Alfred! Hey, come! Alfred, come! <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Hey, hey, hey! Yeah! So, do, do. So, do, do. <laughs> puppy, so, puppy. You don't even know, like nail polish. You don't like the smell. Remember? <laughs> he hates it. I feel like holiday, it's the day that make people who is lonely feel even lonelier. But it's a good time to gather everyone from the whole family together. I don't know. It's usually a lot of drama. <laughs> I thought it was a Chinese New Year thing, but apparently on Christmas, it's the same everywhere. Like. Who's gonna host it? Who's gonna in charge with the food? And what time should people arrive? Sometimes it causes a lot of problems. <laughs> no hustle. Just focusing on doing my nails. If you're like me, spending Chinese New Year aboard, don't feel lonely. I'm here with you. I know you probably see um social media that lots of people gather together have meals have some activity and the children it could be nice but it could also be lots of drama because people don't post those drama maybe they wrote about it on facebook or something <laughs> but on instagram people just post like the best video and the photos don't ever trust the images. It's how funny that people behave differently on different social media as well. I mean, on Instagram, I feel there's more have to be a perfect life, perfect family, perfect trip. But on Facebook, I'm lots of people just like wrote how they actually feel feel and complaining about their life sometimes hmm. i think i did a pretty good job this year my dad is home and he celebrates chinese new year with my brother and my grandpa and my aunt i think like older things online maybe and then they just heat it up i think that's nice don't need to hustle it's the grocery shopping and cooking. Especially you have to prepare such a big meal for so many people. My grandparents, they have four children, eight, nine grandchildren. So it's a lot of people. And now some people even have great grandchildren. So that's a lot. And my mom, she is in Barcelona with her friends. She told me that she was so happy that she's finally free. She doesn't have to cook. Yes, she get to relax. Ah, this nail, it's not good. To redo this one. I feel like lots of holidays that actually make people stress. It should be relaxing and nice and cozy. Not stress. Nice. But oftentimes, if there's a lot of people, there's stress and everyone has different opinions about everything. So it's not too bad to celebrate holiday on your own. I guess we do feel lonely, but in a way it's be so quiet. So just do whatever you like and chill. I remember when I was a kid and of course we just uh, be around and play didn't really help but I can feel that the adults are very stressed 
about getting ready for the new Chinese New Year's Eve dinner. It's nice that we all get together to eat, but not everyone wants to take the responsibility to prepare and to cook. So that could be the issue. You shouldn't get angry or have like negative emotions during Chinese New Year. It's probably gonna bring bad luck or something. We're superstitious in a way. Everyone is trying to keep the peace, but only on the surface. But you can feel the tension between the adults, which is not so healthy. It's quite toxic environment because everyone is stressed. When I was little, sometimes I overheard what I say. It's quite nasty. And I thought, okay, maybe in Sweden, Swedish people, it's a bit calmer and less drama but it's everywhere it's the same on christmas i heard so many stories from my colleagues and my friend and family friends that they have issued like okay where should we spend christmas together who's gonna prepare food how shall we arrange the time what time to arrive and some things like that and sometimes people have argument and they don't even want to talk to each other feels like it's a hustle everywhere in the world during holiday season at the end of the day people just want to relax so maybe it's just easier to book a hotel resort or go to a restaurant and just enjoy the service and everyone has a good time why does it have to be home anyways i don't get it Maybe it's more cozy, I don't know, more homey feeling. But if you are alone, I know a lot of people are alone actually. For Christmas or for Chinese New Year, of course you can reach out to your neighbors or friends and families if you want to. But if you just okay also with your own company, I'm here with you. You can still do fun things, you can still clean, you can still do your nails, you can still make a good meal and live a drama free life. Could be a blessing in a way. Just wake up, fresh up, clean the things, change to new things. Like if the things are bad, you can change the new to new things and it's another beginning of the year. Every time we celebrate Lunar New Year's. I feel like I got second chance to have a New Year resolution. It's a beginning, <laughs> another beginning. In case you fail for the past one month, you can start over again. Got a second chance. This is nice feeling. Nice. I think I did left hand a bit better than my right. Cool. Nice. Nail down. I'm gonna do some Chinese words. Yeah, Chun Lian. 春联，恭喜发财，新年快乐。